What is inflation? Inflation is like when prices at the store slowly go up over time. It's like when your favorite chocolate bar used to cost $1, but now it costs $1.50. That's inflation. Things are getting more expensive. Now, why does this happen? There are a few reasons. 1. More people want stuff. Sometimes, lots of people want to buy the same things, like the newest video game or the latest fashion. When everyone wants the same thing, the stores can raise the price because they know people will still buy it. 2. Costs go up. Think about making a sandwich. If the bread and cheese you use get more expensive, it might cost you more to make that sandwich. Businesses are like that too. When it costs them more to make something, they often charge you more to buy it. 3. People expect prices to rise. Imagine you work at a store, and you know that prices are going up soon. You might ask for a higher salary because you want to be able to afford things when they get more expensive. This can start a cycle where wages and prices keep going up. 4. More money around. Sometimes, the people who control the money in a country, like a bank, decide to make more money available. When there's more money in the country, it can make things cost more because there's more money chasing the same things. 5. Inflation can be good and bad. Good inflation. A little bit of inflation can mean the economy is doing well. It can encourage people to spend and invest their money, which helps businesses grow. Plus, it can make it easier to pay back loans because you're paying with money that's not worth as much as before. Bad inflation. But if prices go up too fast, that's not good. When prices rise super quickly, it can be hard to plan for the future, and people might lose confidence in their money. This can cause problems in the economy. To keep things in control, the people in charge of money, like the government or central banks, use tools to make sure inflation doesn't get out of hand. They might change interest rates or do other things to keep prices from going up too fast. So, inflation is like the slow increase in prices over time, and it happens because of different reasons. A little bit of inflation can be okay, but too much can cause problems. The important thing is that people in charge keep an eye on it to make sure it doesn't get too high or too low. Answer the questions. What is inflation? A. When prices at the store fluctuate randomly. B. When prices at the store stay the same over time. C. When prices at the store go down over time. D. When prices at the store slowly go up over time. Why do prices rise during inflation? A. More people want stuff. B. People expect prices to rise. C. 
Costs go up. D. All of the above. What tools do people in charge of money use to control inflation? A. Giving more money to the people. B. Asking businesses to reduce prices. C. Encouraging people to save their money. D. Changing interest rates. Which of the following is a reason why prices can increase due to inflation? A. More people want to buy the same things. B. The cost of production decreases. C. The stores want to make more profit. D. The government wants to control the economy. Why do businesses often raise prices when their production costs increase? A. To cover their increased costs. B. To decrease demand for their products. C. To control inflation. D. To make more profit. Which of the following is a potential benefit of inflation? A. It helps businesses grow. B. It makes it harder to pay back loans. C. It causes businesses to shrink. D. It encourages people to save money. What can happen when prices rise too quickly? A. It becomes easier to plan for the future. B. People become more confident in their money. C. The economy becomes more stable. D. People lose confidence in their money. Who is responsible for controlling inflation? A. Individuals. B. Consumers. C. The government or central banks. D. Businesses. Why might people ask for a higher salary when they know prices are going up soon? A. To be able to afford things when they get more expensive. B. To save more money. C. To decrease prices. D. To stop working. What can happen when there is more money available in a country? A. Prices can decrease. B. Prices can increase. C. People will spend less money. D. 
people will stop working. Thank you for listening. Please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe to our channel.